This is my first walk on the leash with Gus. And on the first walk, I want to let him do the direction and he gets to control the walk. I want it to be as pleasant as possible so that he has a good feeling about walks and he looks forward to them. And so he gets to lead as much as is possible so he doesn't go in unsafe places. But um, we're going to let him uh, have a lot of control and freedom on the first walk. He did very good last night. He didn't whine in his crate. Uh, he whined for one second. I, uh, I asked him no. I said no. And he just was quiet for the rest of the night. So he did not pee or poo in my house. So that is also good. He, he peed outside. No, no, let's not eat that. Okay. Um, a lot of times puppies will try to put uh, twigs and branches and, and stuff they find on the street uh, in their mouth. And then they're going to get diarrhea later. So we're going to make sure that doesn't happen. Good, good, good. And so it's just uh, helping him learn uh, how to walk on the leash uh, correctly and go in a specific direction. Like I said, the first walk, no pressure because just getting him to be comfortable with the collar, comfortable with the leash, and um, just uh, guiding him to, you know, away from uh, unsafe things, like, like too much uh, putting stuff in his mouth and stuff. Come on. Good, 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 good. And another good thing about walking is it usually stimulates a poop urge in a dog. So I'm looking forward to that because I want him to poop out here where it's the, it's the perfect place to poop.